Hey guys, how's everyone? Now I'm trying my best to play some King of Games and the ladder is quite hard, it's quite messed up. At the moment I'm climbing with Ninja. As you can see from my deck list, I have Red Ninja, Red Ninja, and Mask Ninja, Nibisu, and some Crimson Ninja, Silver Ninja, and some spells and trap cards to help me to get around with some irritating things. Alright, I'm still Pentanium 4. The ladder wasn't too good for me, I wasn't really playing well. So much of things going on and if you like this video, kindly sub and give a thumbs up and share with your friends. The first replay that I'm gonna show to you is kinda I would say I miss play a lot. <laughs> Well, it's against a Cyber Angel that, that I think I did well, but my concentration is a bit bad <coughs> at the end. But I still managed to get a win, so let's check out the replay. So I open with Brad Ninja, which is good because I do know that for Cyber Angel that Brad Ninja is it's pretty good to. You know, cancel out its effects as I'm gonna show you later. I think his starting hand is pretty good. I mean, hit the 10 and he has Ben 10. Same old, same old combo. So, my turn. I definitely need to draw more cards because I need more trap cards to help me to go around. Because the whole idea is to get Brad Ninja out and survive the next turn. So I just put Brad Ninja, he has a Karibo. I have a spell and a Silver Ninja on my hand because I know that when the Kini is out, I can use that Ninja effect to, you know, banish Dakini. And he was like, oh, game over, your boy. I was like, nah, I do duplication first, spreading my Brad Ninja to two cards. Two is more than enough because your life point is 1000. You wouldn't want your life point to be lesser than, than that. So I use uh, the effect to cancel out Ben, Crimson Ninja, and I left with the Green Ninja. And once he wants to attack, I use Transformation, bring out another Brad Ninja. And if when he attack, I use his effect, banish. I'm controlling the game as of now. Feeling confident, I always have a spell and a monster on my hand to keep on banishing if I need to. But here is where I misplay. When I attack, I was greedy. And I didn't want to banish myself because Dakini will come back. That's a misplay on my side. And now I have an army spray. The great ninja is out because I want to see this stupid trap card. And I was right to do that, honestly. But it doesn't matter because they have face up and I still managed to get the whip. So I think that's all that matters. So learn from my mistake and I hope you guys enjoy ninja decks. I think it's pretty good, honestly. And next game, we are versus a T mirror deck. You can see how the combo I did. I think the combo of Ninja I did really well in this game. So you can see how to play Ninja efficiently and effectively. So do a standby as usual. I have a good starting hand. You know, more cards to her is not good for me. So now my decision is to get more cards out. I definitely need transformation, so that's why I get transformation. And I draw more cards. I decided not to go with too aggressive with freestyle star emotion because I want some life points. I'm not too sure what kind of deck is it playing. So red ninja effect. I take a look, neutral axe. Put it on the bottom of the deck because I have a lot of 
higher attack monster. I don't want him healing, healing. So now I duplicate another Red Ninja. Take a look at this card and another neutral axe. And I was like, ah, fuck it, man. Just go top with that. Red Ninja is up. And give me a me three. And again, but come on. I have so many cards in my hand. You should know what happened next. Bad ninja effect is just keep on kind of running and just keep on hitting. That's the power of that ninja. I can hit him another two times, I guess. Too bad, dear. Next game, I think, is against a Bun deck. I'm not too sure. A lot of Weaver going on, Amazon rumors, kind of pissing people off, but you know, it's just a, all about dueling. We have to win. Feel free to let me know if you want more questions about this deck. I will try my best to answer and give you more good content. Oh, three back row. So I was thinking, oh shit, I need bigger monster. So, same old trick, draw more cards, but I can't have the big monster. I use a small monster and on the start of the turn, I quickly use a great ninja, try to banish one of his cards to go to the top of the deck, half shot, shut up. And now, the next turn, I do it again. Have another great ninja. Well, this is the power of this deck. If you have the combo, it is gonna be very fast. I just set a card here because I know he has a lot of trap, so I can just easily, you know, destroy one of the trap. I duplicate again, another great ninja. And where the hell is this card? He gave up from there. He can't he can't see that coming. Next game is against. I'm not too sure what I'm against with. It's been a long day for me. I've just been doing video and playing, and my mind is dazed. And my Newcastle game is playing now against Chelsea as I'm rec recording this video. Hopefully, my Newcastle can do well against Chelsea. And. Inching gear that. Let's see how I play against them. Quickly, three star demotion. No bullshit. He econ me. I was like, well, I don't care. <laughs> it's a bit of bad play on his side. Oh, 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 oh my god. His boss is here. He's angry. But that ninja always have some cards in your hand. You can have a good effect. And I think it's kind of GG. Once. Green Ninja is out, he don't activate anything, and I just go for the debut. Now this deck is super consistent, but you have to have be in the right frame of the mind to play this deck, because there are so much of combo, and that's a lot of thinking to do against different decks, so it's a high IQ deck, I would say. This is the last deal of the day. I hope that I can live stream later. I haven't had anything for dinner yet, so we shall see. He kill me, Crimson Ninja, destroy the back row. I have no idea why the hell he destroyed himself, but who cares? It's not my problem. And I just go for three star demotion and have tons of cards in the back row. There you go. This is what Ninja Dex is all about. Oh, but not so fast because it's an OTK in your face, my boy. Alright, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Sub to my channel. I'm having a 40 sub go. Definitely more updates will be coming and I will be giving some giveaway in the near future. This is a very young and new channel. Hopefully, you guys like it. Alright, have a good day, afternoon and evening.
signing out.